Yes, I'm back. So many people have been commenting saying that I was a lifesaver. I thought it was time to make another one. I know it's been a while, but um, I promise you this one is going to be very helpful. At least it was for me. I hope it will save you as much as time as it did for me. Uh, let's dive right into it. So this is an interview situation and as you might have experienced, not everybody gives a satisfying answer all the time or maybe the answers are too long and you want to get rid of a certain section of the interview and it's pretty easy to do, right? So you hit C, um, you get rid of the bit that you don't like, you move it over right over and there you go, it's gone. However, now we've got this really weird transition and some people really like it, uh, they think this is a style. I personally don't, I think it could look a little more professional so what I would do is um, I would just uh, you know adjust this one to wherever I want and then I would make this look a little different and since this is 4k video I can just um, zoom in quite a bit you know to say 150% or something and move it right over like so so it looks quite different from the first clip and it looks way more intentional so this way it doesn't look like the person made a mistake or the answer was too long this way it looks like I actually wanted it to look this way, which is awesome, right? Uh, however, uh, it will happen again right here. Say I get rid of this little bit. I do the same thing. I move it over. And now I want to go back to the first situation, right? To the exact same parameters, you know, the exact same ones as up here. And what I could do, what I did actually, uh, which was kind of stupid of me, maybe, I don't know. But what I would, would do is I would copy these parameters one by one and apply them to the parameters of this clip. Um, little did I know that it was actually a very easy way to do this, which is super helpful for me. And right now I do it all the time and I hope you will do it as well in the future. Uh, I would just go to um, this clip right now, the one with the more wide angle view. I would go to a motion, right click, hit copy or control C or command C, whatever uh, platform you're using go to the clip that you want and then simply paste it. So Command or Control V if you're on a Mac. And uh, as you can see now, the parameters are exactly the same as the first clip. So that's all, that's all there is to it. And you could do it again uh, later on in the interview if you wanna go back to uh, the more uh, zoomed in situation, more uh, of a close up, just go to that clip copy those parameters, so Control or Command C, uh, go to the clip um, that you wanna have like this more zoom in uh, view of and paste the whole thing. So there you go, um, that's all. It saved me a lot of time. Um, I hope you liked it, I, will hope, uh, I hope it will be very helpful to you as well. If it uh, is helpful, please give me a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of this, please subscribe because more is coming. Um, and I will uh, try to answer as many of your questions as I can. Just leave a comment in the comment section below. I will see you in the next one.